Hello, and welcome back to our lesson for the day. Today, our lesson will focus on introducing phonemic blending and segmentation. Materials. The only material you'll need today is your thinking cap. We have three learning targets. The first one says, I can identify a keyword for the constant digraph, ch. The second learning target says, I can follow along in a shared text in search for digraphs. The third learning target says, I can break apart a CVC word into individual phonemes. Read aloud. I have a new poem. It's about my friend Charles. Charles, check to see which children chew cheese with their shiny teeth when they sneeze. Ch this poem is called Check It Charles. It is a bit of a tongue twister. Let's read it again and this time practice focusing on the words together. Charles, check to see which children chew cheese with their shiny teeth when they sneeze. Ch. Did you hear any words in the poem that have the ch sound? I heard Charles, check, which, children, chew, cheese, This picture shows someone about to sneeze. Sneezing sounds like a chew. We hear the ch sound in a chew. The ch is made when letters C and H are together. Now let's say the sound together. Ch. This is a digraph, the digraph CH. Remember, a digraph happens when two letters come together to make one sound. I wonder if we can think of more words that have the ch sound. I'm sure you thought of some great words. Here's a few I thought of. Chick, chips, chain. Did you hear the ch sound in those three words? Yeah, great listening. We know that letters make the sounds we hear in words. Hearing each sound in a word helps us figure out the letters that spell the word. Today, you're going to be sound inspectors as we listen for the sounds we hear in words. An inspector is someone who pays very close attention and thinks carefully. As sound inspectors, you need to pay very close attention to the sounds in the words and think carefully about them. First, I'll say a word like ship, and then you repeat the word. Ready? Let's try it. Ship. Now you say the word with me. Ship. Listen carefully and inspect the sounds as I say the word again and break it apart. Sh. I. Now it's your turn. Sh, I, p. Nice segmenting. Let's try another word. Rich. Listen carefully as I break apart the word rich. R, I, ch. Now I want you to say it with me. R, I, Nice job, sound inspectors. Let's try another word. Say the word thin. Now say the word and inspect the sounds you hear. Thin. Nice segmenting. 
Now we will use our thumb and fingers to help us. Tap your thumb to one finger at a time for each sound you hear, like this. Say it with me, ship. Sh, I, p, ship. What is the beginning sound of ship? That's correct. The beginning sound in ship is sh. What is the middle sound you hear in ship? The middle sound is short i, i. What is the ending sound? You got it. The ending sound is p. How many sounds did you hear in the word ship? Right again, ship has three sounds. Sh, i, p. Okay, sound inspectors, let's practice another word. The word is chop. Tap it with me. Ch, a, p. What is the beginning sound in chop? Correct. The beginning sound is ch. What is the middle sound in chop? If you say short O, you're correct. Short O says ah. What is the ending sound in chop? If you say p, p awesome listening. Let's try another word. This word is wish. Tap it with me. W, I, sh. What beginning sound did you hear in wish? Yes, the beginning sound in wish is w. What middle sound did you hear in wish? If you said I, short I it is. Great listening. What ending sound did you hear in wish? You are correct. Shh is the ending sound in wish. Great listening sound inspectors. Closing reflection. When we want to hear each separate sound in a word, what can we do? Say the sounds very slowly and tap your fingers. Try thumb tapping more words as you read and write today. See you next time.